Hi all you jewelry lovers, it's Cindy the jewelry nurse from Kansas again with my guest, what's your name? Crystal. Your name? Crystal. Uh, we have a couple of jewelry jars, this is our last couple. These don't have a lot in it so we're going to try and knock them both out. Uh, this particular store, um, Goodwill. No, not the Goodwill. The oh. what's the other one? I keep forgetting that we go to. Um, that I think they sort their jewelry. Uh, both of these were marked four ninety nine, but I got a little bit of a discount at the register because she made us wait a while. Uh, still the same lot. Uh, I did find a couple of things. I think kind of snuck by them in the jars. This was. This is actually amber, and I don't think they realized it was amber, but this is an amber necklace. And there was a couple of other small things, I think, kind of and it snuck has, by them that had, like, maker's marks and stuff and on it. And it has but, bugs in it. Yes, it does. Dead I'm, bugs. <laughs> I'm going to just dump this all out, make it easier to get to. And Those crystal. Like, look, oh, these are little kitty earrings, right? E yeah, uh, some of them, they dangle a little too much. Go ahead and start showing it. Some, these, uh, these are, I'll be able to Remember wear. Remember what I said about showing it to the camera? There you go. Show it to the camera. And it go like this? Yep, if you can see it these in the camera, they can see it. What kind of earrings? Like, probably, some of them are like for kids and grown-ups. These are like for two earrings. They're mostly rhinestone earrings, right? Yep. Yep. And pearls, okay. Next. What this pearl on that? This is no, I think pearl, mostly right? rhinestones. That yep. Oh my god! It's just a beetle. It's okay. It's just a beetle. It's alright. Hey, I think I found a part of a bead. <laughs> okay, here. Crystal, it's not gonna hurt you, honey. It's just a beetle. Yep, you sure did. Okay, so next we have Fall just pearl. like, yeah, pearl, fake, fake pearl Mardi Gras beads. That's what happens when you film outside. You got to deal with the critters. Okay, and another one of these. I think we had one of these in another did jar. You? This one actually yeah, we has did. a... Yeah, we did. It has a twin, but it's white. Yeah, this one actually has a hang tag on it that says something. Let me see. Um, if you can't read it, I see. Hold on, let me see if I can read it. It says, Sarah, oh, this is Sarah Coventry. So the other one must be Sarah Coventry, too. Because they're broke um, for sense. Yeah, it's no, just blue God. acrylic beads, but it does I'll say Sarah right Coventry on the tag. Okay, if you want to show something, start Ollie. showing it. Oh, Ollie, that hurt. <sighs> This is a choker. Choker, yep. Faux For leather. Kid. Just has a rhinestone in the middle. And uh, yeah, that would fit me. That fits. That lobster fits. class looks kind of cheap. Dang, this is heavy. This is like a grown up necklace and it's really heavy. Wait, does it stick to a magnet? Um, probably. Yeah, it looks like a belt. I think it's actually a belt. Stretch it out. Let's see how long it is. Yep, that looks like a belt. Whoa, nice belt, though. That? It's got some enameling on it. It has a blue end. Yeah, it's not bad. Okay. Oh, this one still has a tag on it. Yeah, they probably... She did tell me... Yeah, it says made it's in China. That, you know, after it sits there for a while, if it doesn't sell, they do throw it in a jar, so... You know, like I said, for the price, you can't really complain. It has a vintage clasp, but it also says Liz Baker Essentials. They cut the tag in half and made in China. But it's not bad, actually. It's um, Cindy, would these not fit bad me? at all. It's a little rose print. Cindy, would these fit me? No, those are too big for you, sweetie. You can show, are, show them to the yeah, camera. The these are like these are like guitar. I'm getting close so I can see the guitar. They're the shape of a guitar pick. Is that what you're trying to say? Yeah. Yeah, they are. Um, you, you can probably even use them as a guitar pick. Yeah. These are the clamp type 
non-pierced. They're kind of. Uh, they're non-pierced. Yeah, they're pretty, but they feel kind of lightweight and cheap. No maker's mark. I don't, I don't know what and they don't stick to the magnet, but they don't look very well made. Okay. All right, next. I hate those. Can I, is this Here's a, a blue pierced post earring. Just has a blue bead in it. This is a earring. Doesn't stick, so possibly brass. Where's the other one? Make this. Just some white button type earrings. Well, this says something. A. Plastic, a, God loves you type stick pin. And another one? The other earring. At least we do have some mates in here. That's a pen. You can show them that. Oh, that is really... Key train. Has a very, very tiny... Let's see if you can see that. Brooch. Tiny, tiny. What's and this? And it says... What's should this? have gotten that magnifying glass. I don't know. Show it to the camera. Oh, this is a... This is a bracelet, I think, and it says something on the back. I'm going to have to. Oh, yeah. Ah, this <laughs> says, this little pen, it looks really old, says Scruggs, Vander. And it does stick to the magnet. Vandervoot, and it's Barney, Ink. St. Louis, Missouri, so I'm not sure what this, that is about. This kid's Hard bracelet. To show it. We're losing our light, kind of. This bracelet sticks to the magnet and it says something. Here, let me see. What does it say? Kathy something. I think you can probably read that without the magnifying glass. Kathy Van. Kathy well, she's Van. doing that enamel earring. Don't see the mate to that. A. I, Ka Kathy Van Island, it says, right? Kathy Van Island. Hold still. Kathy Van Ireland. Kathy Van Ireland. So I didn't know Kathy actually had any jewelry, but it looks like a keychain. I didn't know she had jewelry, but it's a nice keychain. But it says Kathy Van Ireland right there. Okay. This okay. is a grown-up earring, and it has real pearls, right? Real pearls? Um, no, those are faux pearls, and it's pretty dirty. I don't see the mate to it. It's a post. You would want to clean it off. Yeah, I'd say. You want or to clean we it might all clean off. it off. Hey, look, here's another guitar pick. Oh, that's a mate to the other one. One got put in the jar. And there is a set of these pearly button earrings, fake pearl. This they is a. Are... What is this? Yeah, what, what is this? Oh, well, that one just fell apart. What was it? That earring, the clamp on earrings just fell apart. Like this? Here is a, looks like Lesnar. I'm going to read it and see if it's Lesnar. This Lesner. is. Nope, it's Crown Trafari. It's a little worn. And it is. Actually, this is a pretty old crown trafari. This okay. is a picture of the USA. That's the real shape of the USA. And it has an M on it. And here Get is it a... Off. Okay, don't... It's Get just off. a beetle, honey. This Get is off. just a button pin. It says a well-tailored queen, <laughs> which I kind of like, a well-tailored queen. We have to wear that one. A just plastic stretchy pair of gold hoop earrings. No maker's marks. What else, Crystal? Well, this is my of a mother of pearl, right? It's my yeah. mother of pearl. 
Looks Here's like another Trafari. This looks this really like, old. Oh, this is a kitten's necklace, right? It's a, um, that Hello. says Trafari, too. I don't know if the maid is in there to either one of these Trafaris, which it is probably why it's in here. It has a tag. This is and a, it's the old clamp-on type. This is a kid's necklace. Or This is a kid's necklace, and it has a mother of pearl, and it has a tag on it. What, let me see what it is. Well, you read that. I'll keep showing other stuff. Here's a pair of, these are nice, these are enamel earrings, they look fairly well made. No marks on it, but they're cute, they're sort of camouflage colors. So the colors tell me they are from the 70s, kind of. Those are colors that were popular in the 70s. Oh, I did find that other earring, so I do have the mate to that crown, Trafari, if I can clean that up. Those are nice, they're fairly old, too. But, yeah, they look almost like wings um, with a star. Those are kind of nice. Hope I can clean those up. Then another, we're in Kansas, so Tom. we're getting a lot of Kansas Tom. memorabilia. This Tom. looks like a hair tie with the KU bird. What did she say that standard stood for? The KU, do you remember what Sue said? KU. Right, but what did she say KU standard Jayhawks? stood for? Yeah, Kansas City Jayhawks. Oh, we do have the mate to that. Aren't we lucky on that one? Yeah. That one's dirty, too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, even in its day, I can't believe somebody bought that. What's next, Miss Crystal? Uh, I'm still trying to figure this out. This is kind of cute. It's a lever back, sort of a southwestern look. Got some faux, um, it's got some wood beads, a faux pearl little flower. This is kind of cute. I hope the maid is in there and it's the lever back type. That's cute though. Hope we get the other one on there. I can't, I can't I like figure that this one. out. I can't figure it out. Okay, let's see what it says. Go ahead and show them something else while I look. This is actually made out of mother of, like, pink dyed oh. mother of pearl. This is kind of pretty. Idiot. Hey, watch what you're saying. I'm talking about dogs. I know, but watch what you're saying. Okay. Show them something else while I'm reading it. This is a it's a grown up's necklace. And of course I just got caught. This says you something. I can't actually read it myself. I'll have to look it up later, but this does look like it has all natural stones on it. It's kinda cute. This is be really good with the summer outfit. It's really cute. I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna have to double this. I think yep. you. I think you wear it like this, right? Yep. You can go ahead and show. You wear it, it like this. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, you can double it if you can, if it'll fit. This is a like a like a silver plastic bead necklace from Grown Up. Oh, my little Grown Up. <laughs> Here's a pendant with a chain. It's a blue card looking rose. Uh, looks like it's made out of acrylic. I do see a seam there, so it's molded plastic and it is really tarnished. So it might be, I don't know what tarnishes besides silver and nickel, but it is pretty tarnished chain. This is a really old little teensy gold pen and it says, 100 on it with like a I put lots of birds on it Can I show them it like this? Yeah, if you can I doubt they'll be able to see it though Whoops, let me see what you're showing Yeah, I don't think they'll be able to see it. What is it? It's a little pen. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, it's one of those little tiny pens um, I wonder if it has a little buddy. It says a hundred on it, so I don't know. It must be some kind of uh, commemorative thing. It says a hundred down there, but the rest of it are... You would want to clean it. Can I have just that? Just some kind of symbols or something. So I'm actually going to get to have some of this stuff, Yes, right? you are. We'll go through it when we're done. And this actually says Janet. It's, it's like the wrist like a watch band sort of style it says janet on it let me see the glass it says something inside too 
it says, okay, this is 12 karat, um, 12 karat gold filled. It says 1 20th, which you can engrave on um, gold filled because it's a little bit thicker. Gold plated, you can't really, but gold filled you can because it looks like they did some engraving. Inside it says, love Bach, be okay. So it was to Janet, love Bach. And it has a little bit of wear on it, but I think it'll clean up. But, you know, how many Janets are there out there that um, are loved by Bach? So. What's this? What's this? Do that is a, yeah, it looks like is this it. A, is this yeah, a it's a broken. It, no, it was a necklace, but it's coming apart. It's that really thin. And it, oh, and thin it says stuff. something. Let me see what it says. Let's see what it says. And it, where's the glass? Right there. Oh, uh, this is kind of cute. It this says, is a charm bracelet, and it has a lot of Asian writing on it. It's kind of cool. Coins and it says BR. It says BR, which I have yeah. no idea what it means. That's kind of cool. Pearls. What does it say? Let me it see. does not have any kind. It looks like it did have something on it, some kind of a hang tag, but it came off. But that's kind of cute. Charm bracelet. Let me see. And it's the double link chain, so nice. Let me see, let me see what it says. It says BR. You can't. It doesn't say anything, and it doesn't stick, so it's probably made of brass. Oh, I did find the other Trafari earring. These are really, really old earrings. You don't want to clean those off, definitely. Yeah, it's like a little pearls. basket, and it's enameled, but some those of the enameling pearls. is coming off, but that's kind of cool. Very old Trafari. Actually, I don't think it even had a copyright on it, so probably from before 1955. Okay. Next, I have this, and this is really cool. It looks, these look like they might be, yeah, these actually look like real pearls. They are hooked together with, um, oh, that's kind of a cool clasp, almost a nautical looking um, spring clasp. Spring clasp is working, and it does have a tag on it that says, 1937 which i think is a jewelry company not the year but that's kind of nice that i could that i would probably post it's nice what next crystal what's up next girlfriend oh, i'm putting this on bag of bobby pins yeah i don't know why they put all that crazy stuff in a jewelry jar that is not jewelry this, yeah, this looks like possibly Claire's, but it's cute and it is in good condition. So um, maybe a, a lot. Yeah, that's kind of cute. Yeah, I think it's plastic beads, but it's, it's fairly well put together and kind of heavy. So it looks like something though you would buy at Claire's, even though it doesn't say Claire's. So I don't know, but that's kind of cute. And then this, I don't know if y'all remember, if you're as old as me, you probably do. And this looks like it's coming apart, but that can be put back together. But this is that mustard yellow color, kind of popular, like uh, 90s maybe, I think. But uh, It looks more orange on there, but it is that mustard yellow color. What next, Crystal? You want to show something? Yeah, Miss Crystal's distracted today, so <laughs> a lot of chains in here. This is a, looks a little bit tarnished. It does have a ring on it. This might be for mail. Let me look at it. Where's the, see if it has any marks. It does look like it's a decent chain. It's a short one, maybe a 16 inch chain. Looks a little tarnished, like it could be vermil or just 14 karat plated or 12 karat. 
yeah this does have a mark on it so this might be one that they missed let me see if I can read it so all the mark is almost wear, worn off but I think this is actually 10 carat that would be nice this is a cute that show them something else while I'm looking honey I want you to do okay well yeah this says 10k and not gold filled it just says 10 karat gold awesome and they missed that because you can barely see it on the spring ring <gasps> This is wow, a ring. so that is actually a real gold chain. I know they missed that one. That wouldn't be in there if they'd seen that. Is that a real pearl? Um, that's let me like, see. That's a ring that can that fits me. It fits me. Is that a real pearl? I don't think it's a real pearl, but yeah, you're right. It does fit you. No, nope, that's a little tarnished, but that one fits you. Fits your middle finger, so all yours. This is a faux pearl ring. Yep, faux pearl. Can I put this in my jar? Um, yep. Yes, ma'am. I wonder what else I can have. We'll go through all that when you're done. There's quite a few things you can have. Here are a set of post earrings, pearls, like faux pearls. But they're two different colors, so I don't know if they're, they go together. Let me see. No markings. Yeah, they're not, they don't match. That one has a different size post. I so. think I see the matching one. Do you see another one? Um, here is one of those. I found, the, I found a matching one. All righty, yep. One has got a mate. Here's a little gold ball. It's like a pinkish. I know the girls in the military can only wear certain size gold balls in uniform. So I see a lot of those in my jewelry jars from... Um, uh, can I Virginia have Beach when I'm at home. Look, yeah. This yeah, is we'll we'll go through it all later, Crystal. And here Yucky. is a kind of southwestern style. These are kind of cute. I don't know. I haven't seen a mate yet, but those Jeez, are kind of cute. Jeez, this is um, really let's old. See if it sticks to the magnet. Oh, there's the other earring. There's the other pearl. So we did have two sets of pearl earrings in there. Yeah, this she has is another not, pearl. Well. Part of it's sticking, but part of it is not. So, yeah. Here's a green pearl. Like a green pearl. Oh, yeah. I think we had three pairs of Just pearls Just answer her phone. Jack, can you get my phone? Here. Oh, this is really cute. A little... Those really, really tiny seed bead yeah. necklaces. Okay, just tell them I'll call them back. Crystal, please. That's kind of so, cute. It's, it's just about a point. Oh, yeah. Don't worry about it. Just hang up. I'll, I'll get it later. Just let it play. Apparently, I have an appointment when I get home. You know what time they said? Yeah, don't answer if it rings. Just let it go to voicemail, and I'll get it later, sweetie. This says... C-O-O-E-E. -E. -E. I don't know who that spug, is, but this spug, is really spug, cute. Spug, spug. Has a lobster claw class, so it is more modern. But lobster claw class did come out in this is like a real 1990s, somewhere around there. I'm going to do a video on the different types of fasteners, kind of give you all an idea of. I'm going to do a little bit more research, but kind of give you a little bit of an idea of when the different style of clasp and stuff came at, come out. So you um will know but you know just because it has that lobster claw doesn't necessarily mean it's not vintage because the lobster claw class did start in the 90s like the early 90s so some of that stuff could be vintage this is just a plastic like the fishing wire type plastic beads Jack, nothing special look how old this is guess what we this is a really old brass ring, and it already, I already tried it. Just not like, hey, I found them, buddy. Okay, show it. Okay, we got that one. Show them that you got to show it to the camera, sweetie. Cannot believe we found an actual 12 karat gold chain. They missed a nice one. Okay, Can I this, have this? Yes. 
This is just a little tiny heart, which, um, according to Tanya and Angie, hearts are supposed to be in for the fall. Um, yeah, no maker's mark, but it is cute. It does look like it could be sterling, but I don't see a mark, so probably not. Let me see if it sticks to the magnet. Where's my magnet? Nope, not sterling. Okay, plus we got quite a few um, hey, keychains in this one, Spain Jack. and Peru, so somebody must have taken a If you hold up your hand, trip. he'll think you have a treat. Okay, crystal. Um, I have another one of these beaded. These look like natural stones. It looks like it's got, um, I don't know, maybe jade on there, little pieces of jade and coral. You hear that? That's Let me an see airplane. if it sticks. Maybe faux jade and coral, but that's what it's supposed coral? to look like. Yep, no, probably fake. Probably that's, plastic. That's fake but it is coral? cute. That's yep. supposed to be coral? Yep. Now, this I kind of like. What is that? This is, this is a necklace. It's a um, seed bead necklace, but it has a. Uh, Jack, see? Has it's a string of what well, almost it's looks like black coral going through it, which is kind of cute. Needs a little bit of straightening out. Has a lobster claw, so a little more modern. But I like that. I have a bunch of those um, multi-strand seed bead necklaces that I'm probably going to make a lot of. And just some Mardi Gras beads. Uh, and dealing with the usual tangles here, guys. Trying not to spend too much time <laughs> untangling, but... Okay, so this is another okay, thing they wait. said would be in style for the fall is... Um, Just chasing yeah, a Yeah, chain style necklaces hey, with um, Jack. stuff hanging off of it, basically. Jack, and he's chasing a is, squirrel. Okay, shh. Okay, if you want to talk, you need to go over there. This is Leah Sophia. But this is kind of cute. Plastic beads, probably. Oh, no, those are glass. Nope, they're plastic beads. You can tell by the facets are not, um, they're not real crisp. They're plastic. Okay, but it is kind of cute. Does Yeah, it has both glass and plastic. The smaller beads are glass, so that's kind of nice. I might post that. I've got quite a few pieces of Leah Sophia, so I'll probably do it in a lot. Uh, everything else here is tangled up, so I'm going to pause for a second and untangle.